Hey guys, how are you doing? Today we're going to be learning how to do a website rather quickly. All right, let's take a look at the screen here. Move myself out of the way. When you come on Builder All, you're going to see the Pixel Perfect Builder. Okay, so we'll click into that. That'll take us to another page. Take a look at the um, all the web, the templates that are available. Down the left hand side here, you, you see a membership area, you see uh, sales funnels, landing pages, uh, you see a blank page, which is great. You can make the um, the footer and the um, the navigation bar at the top really small, so just like a line, which is great because I had uh, struggled with WordPress for a while. They are always having to hire someone to do that for me. Can never really figure it out. Um, just on the side, WordPress is actually coming to Builder also. If you are an avid WordPress lover, then I think that you're going to like that. A Builder all will be able to host it. So there's all different types, design agencies, health and beauty, events, music, fashion. So you can go through the different templates here. Really pretty. You know what I like about it is that you could do anything that you want. You could, um, you could layer it, which again, working with other platforms, I was really restricted within the box when I did a drag and drop. This allows you to layer it. Um, you can add text, you could add video, so much that you can do. So we'll take a look at um, these templates. Again, a lot of these are sales funnels. You'll just have to choose a website that you like. But once you choose the website, you'll go in and then we'll edit it. For teaching purposes, I, I usually like this one. So we'll just start, click on that. I'm going to go right over because it's already opened. We're going to edit that builder and we will, we are now in the editor. So I'm going to take myself away as best as I can. Right from the top, this is the pages of the website. So when you click on that, that's going to open. Um, and this is, how do I say this? Like, um, basically, it's a layout. So if you wanted to do a membership area, which you can definitely do, you would do another layout and then this would be locked in. All right. So if that makes sense to you, if you're not familiar with websites, I'm sorry. All right. So we're going to go through the home about services contact really easy what's great about this is that you can just go into the layout settings you can add a favicon if you want this all has to do with search engine optimization when you're doing a website you want to be found right so adding nice if you're going to research ahead of time you know what your industry is what keywords long tail keywords you want to use you would use those in the description here as well as throughout the website you would do keywords um meta tag if you were going to do um, facebook ads the pixel would go Go here if you're doing analytics which I strongly recommend you need to know where your traffic is coming from right so Google Analytics would go there so that's basically how and that's for each page so it's great for search engine optimization all right what else can I show you um, this going down here this is the text now a lot of people think that you just click this and you add text you don't this is how you format the text throughout the website most websites have about um, three four different fonts so this is where you would send it up these are very you know plain looking but at the same time they're easy to read now if you didn't like these and you wanted to change them say for instance like h3 I don't like this I want to change this so you would click on that and that would allow you to um, open up an, another um, program and that you would be able to then go ahead and change that font so we can do that the other option that we have is um, let's see you can there's a mobile version and a desktop version they are also coming out with a responsive builder so you just have to do one but I've um, formatted this a lot of times when I do mobile I pull things out of my desktop version anyway to be honest with you so you can change the fonts you can also change the type of um, the type of font that you have there's lots to choose from I don't know if you like bold or script or um, the bottom line is you know I could quickly go through these there are a lot to choose from so um, you can see see them all right this, there's going to be something there that you like so again that would be setting it H you know the H1 H2 H3 so you don't have to keep changing it and you would set the sizes as well now say for instance you actually um, have designed this but then you know you want to change this one line here well there's a couple things you could do if you don't like the line you can delete it and then um, I'll get over here but there's a way you can add more text to it you can also just go on and right click it and that will open up um, this window here you can delete it you can duplicate it you know um, you can do parallels with this but let's go ahead and just change the font so this is Montresat light um, what you can do is just go down 
and again just change it you just have to make sure that you're going to click use a new style and again all those fonts will come up all right so that's how you do that uh, if you don't like the um, black you could change all the different colors here you can also put images but again the images are kind of hard because you know you want to be able to read the navigation bar but you can certainly do that you can change any of this image if you didn't like it you would just right click it and you would go into appearance and the appearance will allow you to get um, full screen all the way across, partial, where you have like, you know, clear um, on the side. You could do colors. You can change the images just by clicking and then uploading another video. Uh, uh, you can actually upload a video. You can do a video background. Um, you can do colors. You can do shadow. What else can I show you? Um, so that's basically how uh, these are set up buttons you're going to configure them you want an action where will this go if you want to know more you take them probably to another website um, i'm sorry another portion of the website another page of the website again all of this can be moved if you don't like yellow you change it if you don't like font you just change the font you could um, increase it decrease it lots of different things that you can do as far as moving it around and also changing the shape of it um, Let me just grab that, move it. Banners. Um, if you don't like this picture here, we're just going to get rid of it. We can move it. We can take this whole thing here and just move it over. We could put a whole column here. However you want to do it. It can be moved. You can put the car over here. How The bottom line is it's really easy just to drag and drop. Well, what about going up? Like over the banners see very easy you just go just drag and drop it you're not restricted with boxes at all same thing here if you don't like the color you just change the background we went through the fonts how to do that we went through images say you have this area here and you don't like it so what can you do with it well you can right click it and just get rid of it and the whole banner because it's a banner um you could just go ahead and delete it you can then move this up you have the option of going over here and adding. You can add pop-ups, text, you can do auto funnel tags, you can add banners, that would be like a whole section here and, and just you know make the page go down lo longer. Um, when you do delete though, remember I deleted before, I'd have to grab all the other banners below it and just grab and, and bring it up. These are testimonials. So what else? You can add boxes, you can add buttons, um, you can add different images and galleries and a menu and audio and video and social shares, contact forms, email marketing forms, animated counters, hover elements, timers, checkout, sales funnels, blog apps. So it's a blog. And honestly, I strongly encourage you. I know blogs are a lot of work, but I honestly don't think they're dead. And you know, as well as I do, they're going to help you with your search engine optimization. You know, do an article once a week. Um, and if you want to include a video, that's a great thing to do as well. Let's take a look at the different apps that they have. Buy button, buy now buttons, HTML. You can do a webinar. This um, with, I'll go into more videos, but Builder All has a ton of tools. Look down below and you'll see all the tools that it, it comes with. E-learning. So if you wanted to do like a course and then put it on the front page. So when people sign up, they could start doing the course. That's fine. If you wanted to put it in another layout, like I mentioned, you could do a membership area. You can also... Um, just to there's different ways to do a membership area but the bottom line is it's usually in another layout so that you could um lock it out what else can i show you you can anchor you can do shopify you know the tokens for shopify you can do a um you know adding a i tell um like if you're a restaurant if you wanted to do open table so what else can i show you about this website that's pretty much it in a nutshell you are not restricted by any means i think it's if you're beginning it's a great way to just start off and i would definitely take advantage of all the builder all's tools again if you don't know what they are i'm going to be doing other videos so do me a favor like the like the um like the video subscribe to my channel click that little bell so that you get notifications and you'll learn a lot more as I do these other videos. But you can see it's really simple, really easy to work with. Just save as you go. Like I would say with any other program, you have to save as you go. And um, the search engine optimization is a great tool. And it's just a matter of like very simply this, you know, if you have your content and your images all ready to go, you really could knock this out in a couple of hours. If that depends on how, how in depth you want to go. This video background will take a little bit longer. But I, again, it's all about standing out, looking good. You know, there's so much you can do here. Um, so just make the most. It's your your company, your business. You've worked so hard for it. So have a good website. And you're definitely able to do it with Builderall's Pixel Perfect website. It's a great website builder. All right, guys. Have a great day. And I'll see you on another video. Bye-bye now.